Hello everybody, it's me, Alfie Chat, back for another video. And in today's video, I just wanted to uh, talk about some big news. Uh, this, I'm sorry if I sound weird in this video. Um, this this video is not scripted because this is some really big news, so I didn't really have time to script this video. So if I sound odd in the video, then that's why. But we've had really big news uh, a couple of days ago that Sega, the company that made the... Um, Sonic the Hedgehog franchise is going to be buying Rovio, the creators of Angry Birds. To be honest with you, I um, I have a lot of mixed feelings about this news. This has been very controversial in the Angry Birds community as well as the Sonic the Hedgehog community as well. A lot of people are worrying that this could be a bad decision for Rovio. Although, to be completely honest with you, I'm, um, I, I honestly think that this is a pretty good idea, because if you think about it, we could, we could have, like, Sonic the Hedgehog crossovers with Angry Birds, and we could even, and if we're lucky, we could even see Angry Birds games get imported onto consoles as well, so I honestly think that this is a, that this is a pretty good idea, but it's been very controversial in the Angry Birds community as well as the Sonic community. I've seen I've seen Reddit and I've, I've seen Reddit and Twitter going crazy over this news for the past couple of days because this is some really big news we got here. They're buying Rovio for a massive price. They're buying them for like nearly one billion pounds, which is like a really massive price. It's really big if you think about it. To be honest, um, to be honest, I'm not really sure what. To be honest, I'm not really sure what uh, what really um what Ro what Sega's planning on doing but Sega but Sega did say some apparently from what I heard Sega did say something about um about wanting to put about wanting to spread into mobile games and so I'm pretty sure that's the reason why they're buying Rovio because they want to expand their other franchises into mobile media but um yeah again guys this has been very controversial in the Angry Bird in the Angry Birds fandom and the Sonic fandom and Rovio CEO has even stated that they're working on the Angry Birds movie 3 because and that they're working on the Angry Birds movie 3 because um and that they're working on it together they say the script is still in like you know in development like the script's advanced I'm very excited for that and I'm honestly going to watch it so if if the Angry Birds movie 3 does come out and it doesn't and it like you know comes out in cinemas I'm definitely going to watch it, and you can definitely expect a review on the Angry Birds Movie 3 in the future. But yeah, there's um, not much really to talk about in this video, guys. I just wanted to give my opinion on it. I'm sorry if I sounded really weird in this video. This video, like I said, this video is not scripted because um, I've this is just really big news, and I just wanted to talk about it in a video. I'm very excited to see where Rovio goes with this, honestly, because... Um, it's we're living through some interesting times. This is um this definitely is the end of an era and I'm yeah again I'm very excited to see where this goes. Please tell me your thoughts about this in the comments below. Please comment, like and subscribe. Uh I'm gonna go back to making my Angry Birds mini documentary. I'm planning on making a video discussing the history of Angry Birds. So uh yeah. You can look forward to that. I'm sorry if this um, video was um, not that long. I just wanted to talk about it. And goodbye.